Hello friends and welcome to Smart Horizon. In this video we will see the tips and tricks to learn the tables from 4 to 6. We already have done from 0 to 3 in our last video. So let's start. So we will start with the 4 times table. For this we will draw 2 M shapes like this is the first shape that we have now what we will do is we will write the 2 times table till 2 times 4 like 2 times 1 is equal to 2 2 times 2 is equal to 4 2 times 3 is equal to 6, 2 times 4 is equal to 8 and at the end we will place a 0. The same thing we will do with the next m that is the second m. Now what we will do is in the first m what we will do we will put 0 and 0 in the first row that is the upper points of the m we will write 0 0 in the tens place here we place a 0 here we place a 0 then in the lower part of the first m we will write 1 as uh, 1 on the tens place here we will write 1 here we will write 1 except the last one here we will write 2 now we will come to the second shape that is the second m here we will also write 2 and 2 that is on the upper part we will write 2 and as we have done earlier with the first m we will write 3 and 3 on the tens place here at the bottom part of the second m and with the last that is the 0 we will add a 4. As we can see here is our table of 4 like let's have a look here. Four times one is equal to four. Four times two is equal to eight, or you can say zero eight or zero four, whatever. Four times three is equal to twelve. This is the 12. Four times four is equal to 16. Four times five is equal to 20. So we have done with 0, 4, 0, 8, 12, 16 and 20. So we have done with the first M here. Now we will go to the second M. Now as we have done with 4 times 5, now we will be doing 4 times 6. 4 times 6 is equal to this 24. 4 times 7 is equal to this that is 28 4 times 8 is equal to this that is 32 4 times 9 is equal to this that is 36 and 4 times 10 is equal to this that is 4 and 0 oh, 40 so here we have our 4 times table ready now next we will move on to 5 times table. So we will now see what's the trick to learn the 5 times table. For that 
we will first draw two rows with five columns each so here we have two rows with five columns each one two three four and five what we will do is now i'll place zero five zero five zero five till the last column on the ones place so what i'll do is I'll start with 5 as I am doing 5 times table, then I'll place a 0 here, then I'll again place a 5 here, then I again place a 0, 5, 0, 5, 0, 5 and a 0. Next what, what we will do for the tens place is, I'll write a 0 in the first column and 5 in the last column. Here I will write 0 and here I will be writing 5. And what about the other digits, the other columns we have? We will be having pair of 1, 2, 3 and 4 that is I will be writing that is I will be writing each number twice that is on the tens place. For example, 1, 1, 2 and 2, 3 and 3, 4 and 4 and here it's our 5 times table ready. How? Five times one is equal to zero five. Five times two is equal to ten. Match it from there. Five times three is equal to fifteen. Five times four is equal to twenty. 5 times 5 is equal to 25. Five times six is equal to 30. Five times seven is equal to 35. 5 times 8 is equal to 40. 5 times 9 is equal to 45. 5 times 10 is equal to 50. So here we have our 5 times table ready. So next we will learn the table of 6 that is the 6 times table. 6 times tables process is quite lengthy. For this we will draw 2 tic tac toes, 3 rows, 3 columns each. Here I have the first tic-tac-toe. Here I have the second tic-tac-toe. What we will do now is we will again write uh, numbers from 1 to 9. We will start writing from the left bottom column and end up writing 9 on the right upper column. We will do the same for both the tic-tacs. 
that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 and I'll place a 0 outside we will do the same for the next grid 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and I'll place a 0 outside what next next what I'll be doing is I'll be placing 0 in the first row on the tens place 0 0 0 1 in the next row on the tens place and 2 on the third row with this 0 I'll write 3 then we'll move on to the next tic-tac-toe that is the next grid I'll write 3 on the tens place here 4 next row 5 and I'll place a 6 at the end as we have 20 numbers here so as you can see we have to select the 10 numbers that we want how to select them next what I'll do is I'll make a diamond shape in each grid likewise the 6 12 24 18 and 36, 42, 54, 48, 36. And yay, this is one number and this is one number. So I will be using these four numbers with this number and these four numbers with this number. So in total I have 10 numbers. Now I'll write 6 times table with using these numbers. Six times one is equal to zero six. That is this number. This is zero six here. Six times two. We will now move on to the second row of the first grid. That is twelve. This is the number of the diamond shape that I am using. Six times three is 18 here this is the next number that i will be using now i have left with this 24 so 6 times 4 is equal to 24 and the last that is 6 times 5 is equal to 30 this is the number we have outside the grid now we will move on to next grid 6 times 6 is equal to 36. 6 times 7 is equal to 42. I am using these numbers only, the diamond shape numbers here. 6 times 8 is equal to 48. Six times nine is equal to fifty four, and six times ten is equal to sixty. That is the last number. This is an interesting trick to learn the table of six. It's quite lengthy, but I think it's really easy. I hope you like the video. For more tips and tricks, on mathematics kindly subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you get notified when i upload new content thank you for watching